Well, we had to go get some more of the horde today. And uh, we got some help. One guy. One guy volunteered to help, eh? This old Ford there. We're gonna get her in there and start unloading. Beg my part. Okay, so we got the uh, first load unloaded and uh, Kevin or Doug or whoever this guy is that's helping us, he's a real good guy and friggin' that sure helped out a lot because friggin' holy shit. But anyways, uh, this last load, I noticed there was a box that i never seen before, so I, of course I look into it. And there's a bunch of sack and antler magazines for frig's sake. Like I'm talking like a whole friggin' box of sack and antler magazines. So I brought those back to where we got them from, and uh, you know, apologize. yeah, apologize for almost taking your box. Yeah, yeah, we apologize for uh, just about uh, confiscating your box of sack and antler magazine there, bud. But uh, I beg my part. But, uh, so yeah, we're uh, on our way back. Apparently there's a free dinner. This is just what I've been told. I don't know for sure. I think we might be getting bamboozled or slung hoggled even. But apparently, uh, word has it, there's a free uh, free uh, din-din at the old fire hall right behind the shop in Inwood there. So we're gonna go check that out and we're probably gonna be right on time. Starts at five, it's 25 after right now get rid of some of this horde we got. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see that horde? Holy shit! We got like a 16 foot high pile of bikes in the back. It's friggin' awesome. But, uh, oh, all my stuff soaking wet. Dickered. Like, just totally cocked. So, that's awesome. Really, really happy about that. And, uh, yeah, I guess uh, we'll show you the horde when we get there. Beg my part. Oh, beg my part. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Oh, friggin' right. Got some help. Look at the horde in here now. Look at the friggin' horde, boys. There's more horde over here. It is taking over. Yeah. Yeah, the horde's got a hold of me, boys. But check this out. All these people are coming down for free dinners. Right beside Pug Ones. Pug Ones, there's there's the fire hall, that big Quonset hut thing. So all these peoples are here for free barbecues, so we gotta go. We're gonna drop off some more horde, eh? The truck's full of my drum set and stuff. And uh, yeah. So we're looking we're looking good on the horde. I got a I got a line on 200 foot of fence. So we're gonna go along here and along the that uh, line you know the back of this guy's property in the side and then that'll be just about 200 feet so and then uh I'll just gather up more fence and clear clearly just joking about the horde fence like come on beg my card but really use your pliance that's it so i gotta do it. just use your pliance beg my part but anyways i'm hungry i gotta go oh friggin rights man what a perfect time to friggin' move in next door to the fire hall when they have their friggin' their free friggin' son of a bitch dinner. That's courtesy of uh, Brook Telecom. Yeah, Brook Telecom had a dinner at the the, plea, at the fire station there. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna drop off this bit of horde and I got my drum set in the back. We're gonna dump that off and then we gotta go. The dogs have been by themselves all friggin' day and they are gonna be friggin' mad. Oh, somebody's friggin' with the horde? How are we supposed to work out? Oh yeah, it's the... It's the gym. It's it's uh it's the workout uh, workout yard. But anyways, uh, I think we're gonna go cheech. Beg my part. So yeah, right on. So we cheeched and stuff, and uh, had some vittles, got some stuff moved. Everything's cool. Are you are you smoking cigarettes? Are you smoking cigarettes? Oh well, well, well. Are you working on the internets? Trying to finish it again? Oh, I can't even find my place. I had to start kind of almost over again and redoing most of it. That sucks, buddy. I apologize for that. Oh, Let's go to Chooch. Let's go to Chooch. Oh, that's grimy. Gives me something to do while I smoke cigarettes. Yeah. Try to get to the end of the internet. Yeah. Bam and his grimy Chooch, ladies and gentlemen. Anyways, so we come home. And I got some bills and stuff. I don't, I'm not gonna show you that. That's that's junk mail. But anyways, check this out. I got the stamp Vista Print, eh? These son of a bitches. I got the, uh, the this idea from Bill's T Max. Hey, you might remember him. 
He's the son of a bitch who uh, makes all my stickers and my stuff there. He's got a... Oh, I got half it covered up, Bill. I apologize for that, buddy. But uh, anyways, friggin' uh, Bill's got his Check Out Bill's T-Max on the YouTube TV stamp. Well, this is what I got, eh? Oh, come on. One Pug Life Entertainment. Thirty-one ninety-five in Wood Road. Friggin' right. So that's the stamp that I got. And then I got this. Oh, that's like a card holder thing, so you don't mush them up when they're in your pocket. But check this out. Hey, one Pug Life Entertainment sticky notes with a camera, and then we got uh, a bunch of cards and stuff. So let's check this out. Got a bunch more cards made. All this was like fifty-four bucks or something. Hey, look at that. They're uh, they're just you know flat or whatever. They're not shiny. You know, I don't mean they're bent, I mean they're the, you know, the, the sheen, there's no sheen, right? But anyways, so yeah, friggin', uh, we got that all set up there, new address on some new shit there, and friggin' blah, 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 this and that, some different things. So anyways, until tomorrow, don't start shitting out your mouth.